Christine, how are you? Um, this is another creation for the um, Paper Wizard CHA um, debut for their um, photopolymer travel stamps. I'm not sure what the set is called, but it's Italy. I just wanted to show it to you. And this is a project that they asked me to make some projects with their stamps. You saw, you might have seen the other video. I'm not sure if this is going to post first. This is already released at the CHA. When you see this video, it would have been released already at CHA. Just want to let you see this. My title reads, Rome with me in Italy. I like that. Rome, like Rome. The streets and Rome, the city. And then I embossed, heat embossed that. And then I use like a vintage, you know, um, Italy has all the beautiful, um, all the um, buildings and everything are like distressed and aged. And I love that about Italy. There's my title on um, 3D dots there. Um, I wanted to be able to put a lot of pictures because I know that when you go and see it's embossed. When you go to Italy or anything gorgeous like that, you take a lot of pictures. So I put this guy with a foam dot in the middle. So I don't know if you see it's round um, on the page. Yeah. So I love that. And then I put 3 by 4 cards and 3 by 3 cards so they could just scrapbook like a significant amount of pictures on there. And like I said, I use this vintage paper I had, BCWV paper, and I cut this with my dye. Let me show you the other one. And the other one is Love Floats in Venice, Italy. And there is the gondola, and I put some glossy accents on the gondola, and I know you usually have to pay to get inside there and I used the arch because there's a lot of arches there in Venice. I watercolored the Venice sign on watercolor paper. I wanted it to look aged again. The paper's aged. This is um actually though that was K and Company. This is also K and Company. Um that's my favorite designer and I blotched some paint around the edges. I'm not sure if you could pick that up just to show the aged look. Just like the buildings, they look old and vintage. And I put this like on a sepia, Italy, the word Italy, that comes from the stamp set. Um, Venice is a stamp set I had in my collection. So it says, Love Floats in Venice, Italy. Because that's really where you go to do your gondola ride. And there's a lot of water and buildings, water in between buildings, and it's gorgeous. And I can't wait to visit Italy this Sunday. So I put the two roses to add some romance in there, and I sprayed them up with my, um, one of those sprays, I don't remember those sprays. Anyway, and then I background it with some brown and some old writing here. But I love the, you could feel the texture, you can't really see it, but I love the texture and it looks like it's, um, you know, um, old and distressed, like most of the things there. So, thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to put the links down below to this set. This is the Italy, Italy set. And again, it says Gra Grazie. It says Italy. And then all these gondola and all that. So, I will put the links down below. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for the next project. Bye.